All right. We're fixing to try to get her fit stay on video. She's, we've done three so far, um, which I'll mention on the notes. I'm not going to talk about now. I'm going to focus on getting another rocking sit stay sit. Good. Nice fast response. Nice straight sit. Good girl. Stay. Good girl. I was getting some distance today. She's got, she's got a nice straight sit, so I'm happy with that. Sophie, good girl. And I was actually, ah, ah, good girl, getting some distance. Good stay. Good girl, Sophie. Good girl. And if you kind of see the look in her face, a couple of times you saw her kind of look in different directions, and I kind of preemptively corrected that just in case she was thinking of breaking or sniffing something that would cause her to break. Um, she's focused. She definitely does like the treats that I'm working with. Um, good girl. But you can see in her face, what I wanted to point out is, um, you can kind of see in her face, there's a, a, a good girl, there's a degree of, a, of knowing what she's supposed to be doing. She's kind of settled into this sit position and she's looking at me. She's kind of like, here I am. I'm sitting. I'm staying. Whereas when you're kind of battling with it, the dog's more distracted. That's just when either they're distracted because they're young or because of their personality or because they don't know exactly what we want of them. Good girl, stay. Good girl. And we got a minute and 31 seconds right now. Ah, ah, ah. So she just wiggled a little bit. Her stay, oh, there it went. So she went, she went over onto the uh, end there. She went over onto the, her hip, and sure enough, soon after, it goes into a down. So I'm going to pull her up. Good girl. Oh, wow, awesome. And she pulled up into a really straight sit. Good girl. Good girl. That was beautiful. And then I dropped the leash again. She pulled back up into a really straight sit. That makes me very happy. Good girl. Good girl. That also is good in the sense that she's starting to understand when she rolled over and kind of went into the down and I just barely pulled the leash. She, she's understanding, oh, yeah, that's right. I am doing a sit stay. Um, the other times I kind of had to wrestle with her a teeny bit to kind of get her up and back into the proper position and so on. So just working those straight sits for a while and that's it without working the stay really helped. Uh, uh, uh. So there goes the hip. Uh, 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 uh. Good. Good. So she, she, good girl. Still that hip is a little rolled. I'm going to see if I can kind of correct it. Do, do. Nope, I didn't correct it at all. Sophie, I'm going to pull her out of the sit, actually, with a treat and put her back in. Good girl. Now, she's in a different position, but that's okay because, again, I'm just trying to teach her to correct back into a very straight sit. So I pulled her out with a treat, lured her back into a straight, a good straight sit. Um, I, what I did try a second ago was sometimes when you go to um, – to like correct something physically, so I'll show you. Like if I go to kind of push on her this way, she'll she'll do one of two things. She'll either give, or she'll resist. So like if I push on this side, I'm not I'm just barely touching her. But if I push on this side, she might actually give, which she did just then. She kind of moved in that direction, or she'll resist, which means she leans in the direction that I'm pushing her. You never really know what a dog's going to do. So that's what I was trying to do just then with my foot was to see if I could correct her while still in a sit by kind of putting pressure on either side to see which side that would make her, you know, was she going to resist or was she going to go with it. Ultimately, if I could keep her in the sit and correct the sit, that would have been my, my favorite goal. Um, but it's okay. Pulling her out and make, putting her back in a straight sit is, is okay as well. Good girl. And someone just walked in. So. Good girl, good stay, and we've got uh, we four minutes. Of course, she broke a couple of times, but that's okay. That's a very long and a lot of really good practice. Good stay, Sophie. So now I'm going to let her kind of make a decision. Oh, and there's Jason right there, very close by. So she's extremely tempted to walk towards him. He's like, there he is right there. Good stay, Sophie. And she looks back at me. She's looking at John. Good girl. I love that. See, she's making the decision, looking at him, looking at him, thinking about maybe going over there, and then looking back at me. Good girl. And I'm going to release. Okay. Good job. Very good job.